Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Today, I'm going to be doing an unboxing and a review of my brand new Saroyan Turkish Delights in Silver. I am so excited. I've actually had these finger symbols now for a couple of months, believe it or not, but I haven't had a moment to make a video and I wanted to take them out with you so that you could see them all shiny and new and I can sew the elastics into it and give you the first peek at what I think about these, I'm sure to be amazing, finger symbols, yes? So I decided to purchase these as my newest addition to my ever-growing collection of finger symbols because I found out from Virginia over at Soroyan that this is their most often purchased set of symbols. This is their most popular set, the Turkish Delights. And I was like, oh my gosh, these are your most popular set and I do not own them. This is a huge problem. <laughs> so I got myself a set of these and today, my friends, we are going to be unboxing them, sewing on the elastics and playing them together for the first time. Are you excited? I'm excited. Okay, let's do this. All right, let's check this out, shall we? Oh, so excited. Okay. Zills are never quite as shiny as they are the first day you take them out of the package. Here they are, da 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 da, the beautifully shiny Saroyan Turkish professionals. Oh my goodness, they are gorgeous. So I always try to play them without putting the elastics on first because I'm so curious. Let's see, let's see if I can do it. All right, so it's it's elastic putting on time. It's gonna take a little while. So I'm gonna show you one here and fast forward, and then we're gonna jump to the good stuff. Here we go. ready to play. All right, it's showtime, folks. So I have these zills all elastic up and I'm ready to play them. But first I have to say, I don't know if Saroyan is using a new kind of elastic, but these are the thickest elastics that I have ever experienced. And they were a little bit of a pain <laughs> to, uh, to sew, but I can tell right away when I put them on my fingers that they're pretty sturdy and they feel very tight. They don't have as much give as some elastics that I've used in the past. So I'm thinking in the long run, it'll probably be a positive thing, but man, I couldn't even get them through the slots of the zills. I had to use a pair of pliers because they're so thick. I had to literally like force them through the slots with the pliers because of their thickness, but they feel really good once they're on my fingers. Uh, they were just a little challenging to work with in the sewing process. So I'll have to see if this is like new elastics that are coming with the zills all the time. And then of course you can always buy your own elastics if you have a particular kind of elastic that you prefer. All right, let's hear what these babies sound like, yeah?
Mm, these are very nice. I, I really enjoy them. I'm typically more of a brass than a silver Zill player. Uh, but these are nice. They're nice and tuned. And I know that Sorain takes the time to like actually hand tune all of the sets. And so it shows. Um, they're nice and thick. I feel like they're kind of a medium sized Zill. They're not the biggest in my collection, but they're not the smallest either. Um, I like the shape of them. It's not very deep, the bell, but they're really like meaty. Can I use the word meaty to describe a set of Zills? No, I would prefer to not use a meat related <laughs> term. They have a lot of um, heft to them. I feel like they're not necessarily heavy, but they are fairly thick. I don't know if you can see there on the ridge, on the edge, they feel pretty thick. They feel like some of the Zills that I have, like those uh, silver Grecians, are real thin and lightweight. These are definitely on the heavier side. I feel like they might be a little bit thicker than, say, the Afghanis. That's just how it feels to me. I haven't tried measuring them. Um, but it's nice. Like, you can really feel the weight in your hand. But because they're not too big, they're not too heavy. They have a really nice clack. I think the way the rims fit together is quite nice. So I really like, I really like that. They're a pretty simple design when it comes to Saroyan designs. I tend to like the ones that have all the pretty, all the different pretty drawings on them. But this just says Saroyan Turkish Delight Professionals. There's a little star on there and then the ridges around the edge. So they're pretty simple, but very nice. I'm sure I will play the heck out of them and soon they will start to develop that beautiful patina that all of my Zills have. They have a tiny little like, curve on the edge it's really it's they're very nice they're very pretty i'm really enjoying these as far as the basic and the ring they have a nice sustain it doesn't go on and on and on forever like the altages those are amazing but it does have a nice ring it's nice and even and steady how it tapers off um and the ticks are very easy to create even though it's not a very um deep bell i can create the tick with just my usual sort of t-shaped hand and the elastic does not get in my way. You'll notice I did so my elastic, my new favorite way, where there is no tab on the inside. It lays completely flat on the inside. The tab is on the outside, and I actually move it over to the side. You can see it here so that it's not sticking out the top. But I have heard that some dancers leave it sticking out the top, and then they can use it as like a little, a little tab to pull when they put their finger symbols on to be able to sort of open up that elastic. This elastic is so darn thick. I don't think pulling the tab would open it up. And so it really maintains its integrity when you go to put your finger in there. Like it's not moving. It's like a solid wall of elastic. Yeah, so the sounds are really nice. Here's that uh, basic once again. And the clack. And the tick. And the ring. How about a talk? So let's just go ahead and jam out, shall we? So you can kind of hear how they sound in practice. Here we go. So there you have it, folks, the Saroyan Turkish Delight Pro in silver. These are quite nice and a wonderful addition to my collection. And they could be a wonderful addition to your collection, too, if you like what you heard. I will definitely be using these in some upcoming videos. So keep your eyes and your ears peeled for these beautiful finger symbols. And then, of course, if you'd like to get your own set, just head over to sahirabellydances.com slash Saroyan Symbols. 
and have a look-see. I love shopping their site. Definitely be sure to go to Sounds of Saroyan where you can listen to all of them, right? It's dangerous. I'm warning you right now, it's dangerous. But head over there, listen to them, compare these Turkish Delight pros with the others there, see what you enjoy. And then whatever you decide to buy, send me a note, let me know. Even better, send me a video and play them for me. That way maybe you could help me decide what set of Zills I need next. Thank you so much for joining me for this Zill unboxing and review. And I look forward to making music on the dance floor with you soon.